Hey guys, I'm Avil back again with another video. This time it is about this Nokia 6.1 Plus. After the Android 10 update, many of you have commented that the Gcam apps are not working properly on this device. So in this video, I'm going to share with you two APKs which are working. And another thing is that I'll show you how to use the QR code to share your Wi-Fi network. One of my viewers, uh, Rajesh, has asked this question. So Rajesh, if you're watching this video, thanks for your question. So let's get started. First APK that I've given the link in the description, the first one, all you have to do is that simply download that APK and install the app. After installing the app, restart your device and it should work properly. Now let me show you the features here, portrait mode is there, night mode, then camera, video, okay. This slow motion is not working. And another good feature here is that I've found is that the, you know, Astro photography is there so you can get this uh, dedicated you know astro photography button here all you have to do is that simply go to settings okay settings and then px mode settings scroll down and here you have this option show astro buttons now after you turn this on close the app and then restart the app then you will find this uh, option here let me show this okay night side here you can see this option, okay, Astro Photography, and it is working fine. The only thing is that it takes, uh, you know, a few seconds to process the image. Now let me show you that. Suppose if I take this photo selfie, okay, now let me show you that. Okay, it is not crashing, so that is a good thing. Here you can see that it takes uh, a few minutes to process the image, but the quality is really good. Here you can see that, okay. So this APK is working fine. Videos are also good. The only problem is that it takes some, you know, you know, a few minutes, uh, not minutes, a few seconds to process the image. This one is the next uh, GCAM 7 APK and it is really good because uh, it processes the images really fast and only, you know, problem is that it doesn't have the astro photography option. But otherwise, it is performing really well. Let me show you that. Night side is there. It is working fine. Portrait, camera, video. Okay, it doesn't have that slow motion and as I told you, the slow motion is not working on 6.1 plus. So that's the problem here. And let me show you that the process time is really quick. Let me show you that. Suppose if I'm going to take this selfie, click here. Okay, and it takes um, just one or two seconds. Let me show you that. It's done already, right? So this is one thing that I liked about this. So these are the two APKs that you can use up to the Android 10 update so you can use them and you can take good photos. Now let me show you how to use the QR code to share your or connect to a Wi-Fi, right? Uh, first of all, suppose I've already been connected. So I have to do one thing. Uh, suppose, okay, save networks. Where is it? Suppose this one I want to delete, okay, forget. Now what I have to do, suppose I want to connect to this Wi-Fi using QR code, right? This one is the another one, Nokia 8.1, okay, suppose I need to use this one. Suppose I want to share my Wi-Fi with this one, okay? This one is already connected to the Wi-Fi and this one will be connected using the QR code. Now what do you have to do? Simply Wi-Fi, okay, then this one, now here you can see that, you know, tear fewer then you will get this option share okay tap here it will ask you for the password or the pattern now this one can be scanned and this device will be connected automatically now how to do this simply go to wi-fi okay tap here okay now this one is locked right it has been found but it is locked what to do simply tap here okay and you can see that the QR option is there. Simply tap here. So without inputting the password, you can simply scan this one and it's done. Now you can see that it has been connected. So it's very simple. So you don't have to input the password to get connected to the Wi-Fi, right? This is how it works. And I believe that this will help you to use this feature. So if it does, then do let me know in the comment section and do let me know in the comment section about the, you know, the APKs, the GCAM APKs, which are, which I have actually mentioned and whether they are working on your devices or not. Do let me know in the comment section. And if you end up liking this video, then don't forget to subscribe. So till the next video, guys. Cheers.